Doctor, your research uh, is predominantly on toxic chemicals and the, and the rising rate of chronic disease. What kind of conditions uh, or disease are we seeing on the rise and how, how dramatic has this increase been? Well, we're, we're seeing a whole series of chronic diseases in children on the rise. Asthma, learning disabilities such as attention deficit disorder and autism. The incidence of childhood cancer is up 40% uh, over the last 40 years. Uh, obesity has more than tripled in the past 25 years. Mm -hmm. So those are, those are the big ones. And, and how can those be linked to, to toxic chemicals? Has, has that been shown that there's a definite connection there? There, there, are, there are definite connections between certain toxic chemicals and some diseases. So for example, we know that air pollution is tightly linked to childhood asthma, both indoor air pollution as well as outdoor air pollution. We have identified a whole series of chemicals that are known to be able to injure the developing brain of the human fetus to cause uh, loss of IQ, shortening of attention span, and other learning disabilities. That work started with lead. It expanded to include uh, mercury, pesticides, uh, more recently phthalates, brominated flame retardants, bisphenol A, PCBs. We know there's probably about 15 or 18 chemicals that we know with a high degree of certainty are linked to fetal brain damage and then to learning disabilities of one kind or another as the child grows up.